We're here with Bob Woodward, the author of Fear, Trump in the White House. Uh, what makes you afraid? Oh, uh, afraid? Well, what uh, fills uh, you with fear? The, the first is not knowing, and that's what we've got to do. We need to know what's going on. How and will we know what's going on? Because the hallmark of Trump's behavior in this book is from day to day, he may or may not remember what his idea was yesterday. <laughs> yes, yes. Yeah. That, that's true, and that's part of the problem. And you and, also say the so, very last line of the book, not to interrupt oh, you, but uh, yeah. I want to get many questions in okay. here. Well, thank you very yes, much, Counselor. The right. very, <laughs> the very last line of the book, not to give it, it away. It's it, worth reading the it, entire it thing. Has, I promise it, you. It has the F word. It has it. the F word here. Yes. This right. is Dowd, his lawyer, talking about the president. Right. He says, right at the end, yes. after they practiced a session in With the Mueller. White House. And, you know, and the lawyer acts like he's Mueller and he asks the questions of Trump. Yep. And Trump goes ballistic, makes things up, starts screaming. Uh, Dowd thought if he'd been Mueller, he would have been fired right on the spot. Right. And, uh, and he says, Mr. President, you know, either you do this my way or you're going to be fitted for an orange jumpsuit. Yes. And uh, you can't testify. You, you are disabled. I mean, imagine the lawyer, your lawyer telling you're disabled. Right. And you can't testify because you can't tell the truth. You and, just make things up. And I'll say it because I don't have the credibility you do. Dowd couldn't, knew he could not bring himself to say to the president, you're a f***ing liar. And that's how you end the book. Yeah. I think you buried the lead. <laughs> Fair point. Fair point. That should be the title <laughs> of, of the book. Why did, you, why did you want to start with stealing the documents off of his desk and end with that line? Well, because it's all part of what the, you know, this is a reality show. This is what goes on. And there's a middle part, which we haven't discussed, which is national security, where Trump goes off and he has these ideas about we've got to make money. Uh, gee, all the people... Uh, the, I mean, there, there is a scene where there's this great missile system called THAAD. It's the best missile interceptor in the world. The U.S. has it. We put it in uh, South Korea so we can shoot down sure. North Korean missiles if that, uh, God help us, it does, uh, may it not happen. And it's, it is a terrific missile system, and Trump asked, well, how much does it cost? It's a billion dollars. And he said, a billion dollars? And they finally come in, and they show him the lease, and, they, and they're saying, it's great, we got a 99-year lease. And Trump says, who's paying for it? Well, we're paying for it. The United States said, take it out, put it in Portland. <laughs> how, do you feel when the, how do you feel when the president tweets about you? Yeah. I think he's called you what he said, uh, Woodward book is a scam. Don't talk the way I am quoted. If I did, I would not have been elected president. These quotes were made up. The author uses every trick in the book to demean and belittle. I wish that people could see the real facts and our country is doing great. Yeah. How do you feel when the president says you're, you're lying? Um, I'm not. And, uh, <laughs> that, you, I mean, you know, we... Uh, what... <laughs> what... What is the contest in America other than the political contest? It's a contest for the truth. What is the truth? And I'm willing to put myself out here. I've done the work. Uh, this is the best reporting you can do or that I can do. And for him to get up and, you know, he's, look, he has his First Amendment rights. He can say anything. But the great editor at the Washington Post, Ben Bradley, during Watergate, uh, used to always say when there was a contest back and forth, he said, the truth emerges, and the truth will emerge on this, too. Yes, it is, it is slowly coming out. Thank you, Bob. Thank you. Thank you. Fear is available tomorrow. Bob, everybody. We'll be right back.